I'm Ms. Artastic and in this video art tutorial we're going to be drawing this lovely road runner so grab your choice of art making mediums and let's make some art. Alright we're going to be drawing a road runner so we're going to start off on one side of the paper with our beak so a nice long pointed beak, pointy triangle nostril, and then we're gonna go curve and curve like that. Now anytime I'm going too fast, just hit that pause button and join me when you're ready. All right, connect the line down to the bottom curve. And that's gonna give you a nice little Roadrunner beak. All right, next curve line up. And then we're gonna do some feathers flopping forward, just like that. And then bring it towards a neck. Okay, zigzag lines along the bottom for the neck. And then we're gonna draw a short little body. So we're gonna draw back and belly, bring in the wing, just like that. Curve for the wing. We're gonna add a leg. Now it's going, it's in a running motion, so we're gonna draw sort of V shape there and connect the bottom. And then we're gonna draw one leg out, two lines out, and then bring them forward. Whoa, missed one. Like that. And then long Roadrunner toes. Okay. Next, we're gonna have one leg reaching forward and back as our Roadrunner is running. Okay. And now from this wing just below, we're gonna have one line come out straight for a tail. And then we're gonna do big zigzag lines coming back towards the body. And tuck in those tail feathers like that. And then I'll add the remaining wing feathers peeking out at the top. Okay, we're gonna add Roadrunner's eyes. So we're gonna add one circle. And in that circle, we're gonna add one big circle and a tiny circle. And then color in the eye, leaving just those two circles nice and white. We're gonna add some detail lines here and there just by going along the edges of different areas to add some texture. And I like to add a few lines around the eye. Just to add some details there as well. Along the bottom, or along the body, sorry, we're gonna add some texture lines just with some hatching lines. For some feather texture, and you can also add that feather texture on the head. We're gonna add the road below, so we're gonna add a straight line. And you can have the yellow lines just peeking out along the bottom. And then we can add some roadside textures, such as bushes, maybe some tumbleweed, whatever sort of deserty things, maybe some cacti peeking out. In the background, whatever you would like, you can add all those lovely details. and artist flavor to your artwork. And once you're done, you're ready to color in your Roadrunner with your choice of mediums and colors. So grab whatever you would like and let's get coloring.
finally we're gonna shade in our Roadrunner. So we're gonna use a gray to shade around the eye. Wow, that was weird. Along the bottom of the beak, along the bottom of the neck and body. You can shade part of the sun if you want. Any elements in the background, you can add a nice little shadow being cast. And once you're done, your lovely Roadrunner artwork is done. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Please make sure that you hit that like button and subscribe to this channel so I can continue to make amazing art lessons for you. Oh yeah. Well, if you are an art educator or a teacher and you're looking for some cool art lessons for your classroom, no matter what kind of teacher you are, for any grade, check out the Ms. Artastic Teachers Pay Teachers store. There I have over 700 art lessons and of course it's always growing and transforming. So make sure you check it out frequently. But it's the Ms. Artastic Teachers Pay Teachers store and you're gonna find art lessons that are fully planned and easy to use. And you're gonna find some cool art activities to use for all the seasons all the holidays, and so much more. You're gonna find amazing art lessons that are integrating the seasons, the holidays, elements of art, principles of design, and art history, and so much more, my friends. It's a fabulous resource, so check it out. If you're looking for some awesome art ideas for your classroom, you can head on over to teacherspayteachers.com. In that search bar, just click it, and you can type in Ms. Artastic, same as this YouTube channel. There I am, you can click that, and that's gonna bring you to this page. And you can navigate it a variety of ways. You can go down, scroll, and see what's new. Um, these are usually my featured products that are usually brand new. Or if you go down to the side here, you're gonna find the categories of different things. You can click Artivity Books to find my art um, activity books that are fully integrated with the elements and principles. You can find artists and art history, art sub resources, back to school, Christmas, distance learning, and so much more principles of design. Here it's all organized for different themes or the holidays and seasons or types of learning, including sketchbooks and social emotional learning and all of the above. So make sure you check it out, Ms. Artastic on Teachers Pay Teachers, and thank you so much for watching. I'm Ms. Artastic, signing out.